Okay. So, now it's time to go see Manny. I would get a taxi, but we really just have to run over there. Wait, is that a bike? Yep, it's a bike, but we're not taking it. Hmm, I don't know about that bike. Okay. Puerto Rican Connection. Yep, that's definitely the next, miss next mission. But wait a sec. You made me look gay, man. What? Metrosexual? Is that an actual term, or is that just something this game made up? What am I supposed to do here, man? I got this film genius here. Yo, and I just know... Oh my god, Manny has that background. It's like in the style of like a GTA 3 era game. Wow. Wow, Nico looks... Nico looks like he's finding entertainment out of Manny's ridiculousness. Wow. We to go bust somebody, man. Do what you want, as long as it doesn't involve me. Hey, yo, man, we're brethren, right? Give it up, man. All right, man, yo, listen, can you shut these punks up for me, please? Where are they? They're gonna be coming in on the L train, man. From Algonquin to Dukes, man. Hey, I owe you, man. Oh, we gotta follow a train. You see that, man? I think I know this see mission. That, yo, that is streets right there, man. Not none of this shit. Got me dancing in skirts with people in the neighborhood. Well, what the fuck is that, man? Okay. Algonquin Bridge. Oh, wait. You know, I'm going to take the bike because I get the feeling that we have to follow the train and get ready to do so. You know, wait. Nico, safety first. Thank you. It was a little weird to have Nico riding a bike and not Johnny, but eh. Hello. I'm ready to pay the toll. Thank you. I'm a law-abiding citizen. I pay the toll. I would swing by Burger Man, but I don't want to pad out the mission. <gasps> Shit. Um, let's... Turn around, yes. Watch it, watch it. Alright, so now we're at the bridge. And there's the train that we gotta follow. Alright, so... You know, now that I think about it... Not sh I might actually want to discuss the origin of the original GTA 4 Let's Play, and maybe the origin of this Let's Play, since it's... It's freaking... Um... Another project I've been procrastinating on. 
Well, the original Let's Play was made by... was requested by a, an old friend of mine. And I did it for him. That's back when he had a YouTube channel, and now he don't really have a YouTube channel no more. <clears throat> really, the only thing he did on his YouTube channel was make was show off his love of the Xbox 360 by making a slideshow of what he felt were the top 10 best Kinect games. And it got him a lot of views and a lot of hate because, well, people don't like the Kinect. And I think I may have just fucked up the mission, or no I didn't, thank god. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Um, but yeah, that video's not up anymore, and I haven't really spoken to the guy for since. Not since! No, 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 that's wrong. He came to my graduation party from college, um, and we did talk for a couple years after the Let's Play was made, but... Yeah, that's why I made the old Let's Play, because I was, like, harping on people to, like, request what they wanted. And this Let's Play was actually another old friend asked me to do a special for 500 subscribers. the fuck? Is he running at- <gasps> Yo, freaking the frame rate's tanking. And then next up is Elisabetta. The snowstorm mission. Freaking... The mission that Watch Mojo claimed was ridiculously hard, even though there's a very fucking easy solution out of the mission that they failed to even fucking mention. Another person, another channel on YouTube that doesn't do their research. Anyways, so this Let's Play remake was suggested as a 500 subscriber special. Honestly, I don't think of it as a 500 sub special because honestly, I don't necessarily care about subscriber numbers anymore. Like, I really do not. Like, according to my Social Blade profile, I might actually hit 1,000 subscribers by 2021 next year. When it happens, it happens, but honestly, I really don't know if I want to make a big fanfare out of it, because really, I care about the subscribers who... I don't really want to say I don't care about subscribers who don't comment, but really, the, sub the most valuable thing I've gotten out of subscribers is, well people to talk to, you know? Because I don't really get a chance to talk to people that much um, outside of this. And for people who do come in my live stream chat and just talk to me about stuff, like, for that I'm just eternally grateful. Like, to me, that's the most important thing I've gotten out of subscribers, not the number. Like, I'm just, like, sometimes I just wonder, you know, sometimes, like... It's almost like what Angry Grandpa said in one video that was released after his death. Like, 
He was confused, but ultimately grateful that people were able to get entertainment out of him breaking shit and doing stupid things. Like... Me, all I do is just make... Vi like, literally all I do is... Play games that some some play games that I think are underrated games that make me have exaggerated ridiculous rage moments. All right, well, Elisabetta is next. She just triggered the mission. Um, <clears throat> but you know it's funny. Like, I don't really have. I don't really put all that much effort into my videos like sure there was a time when i was studying to be a professional videographer like a video editor like involved in like the professional video industry and then i just left that because i number one it's extremely difficult to get get a job a full-time job in that field and number two like, I came to just really become disgusted with that industry. Like, all the slimy shit that occurs behind the scenes. So really, the only thing that the only thing video related I do nowadays is this, and I make like I put much more effort into this stuff than I did in years past, but still not nearly as much effort as some other professional people on YouTube do. And I'm just sometimes I'm just surprised that. There are, uh, surprisingly, there's a surprising, surprisingly high amount of people by my standards who just stick around and like seeing what I do. You know? Like... When I was younger, like, I seriously thought when I made a YouTube channel, I was going to be insta-famous one day. Like, ooh, I'm going to get famous. I'm One day, I'm going to be famous enough to where I can have a crossover with the angry video game nerd. Nowadays, I realize that crap's not going to happen. Like, now it's the exact opposite, where... Just have to be grateful... For the people who do stick around, because honestly, lots of times I'm in the mindset where nobody sh was should stick around. Where, I, where no, well, specifically, I've been in the mindset where I didn't think anyone would stick around. You know. You're in America now. The best everything gets made here. If the best stuff got made in Mexico or Colombia or wherever, why do you all run across the border? Tell me that. Alright, well, enough with me possibly being melodramatic, even though I am, honest to God, grateful for everyone who does watch and interact with basically... Alright. I mean, you get the idea. I'm just happy to have people who enjoy the stuff and like talking with me, you know? Anyways, enough with the... Enough with the positive emotional support, let's kill some baddies. <laughs> kind of like the way he fell. Alright, ass shot there. I kind of miss, but I got it. Okay... So, today, kids, we're gonna learn why Watch Mojo should not have put this mission on their top 10 hardest GTA missions list. Rocket, 
Might want to duck in case. Give me a smile, motherfucker. All right. I'm going in. Surround it, Garon. Nowhere to turn. Wrong Back time. Off. Wrong place. Yo, is that yo? Oh, I want him to fall down. All right. Some more shotgun ammo, so I've got a shotgun. A little too close for comfort, but. Alright, a little bit stupid of me to do that, but that's okay. Alright, not too much. Oh, that's not an exploding barrel. Are you kidding me? Wait, why is he sliding? Alright, no survivors. Out in the open. Okay. Oops, watch it. Oh. I'm doing you a favor, Hello. You <laughs> oh, no grenades. That sucks. Beat it, beat it. Action. Wait, now it exploded? Oh my god. You're gonna die, motherfucker. Come on. And we have two more in another room, so keep your eyes peeled. Oh wait. Oh. Get more shotgun ammo. Yep, replenish our health. What little we were able to replenish. And watch the explosive barrel. You don't want to be a victim of it. Watch it. Get up! That looked violent. Okay, we got the cocaine for Elisabetta. And now, this escape part is why WatchMojo claimed this was one of the hardest missions in the GTA stop. series. Because the cops are super aggressive and you have little room to escape. But, I'm gonna show you something they completely fucking failed to mention. And I think I did this in the original Let's Play too. so you know what, if I did, well, I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> oh shit. Die! There, save the explosives. Okay. Or watch it, don't bum rush. Wait, why are we down to two stars? It was supposed to be three. You know what, don't complain. Um... Okay. 
Okay. Watch it. Or watch it, watch it. Alright. This is what Watch Mojo failed to mention. Look down there. They complete. They act as though you have to get into a car and escape by car going through all the cops. When in fact, anytime you play the mission, this boat will always, always be here. And all you have to do is ride out into the sunset, you win. The cops can only follow you so far. I mean, that said, I mean, if we're being pursued by that helicopter, I might have to see if I can knock it down temporarily. But, yeah, I don't think that's necessary. Oh, shit, shit, cop, cop, boats, cop, boats. Sh oh, they didn't see me in time. Harngi, harngi, harngi. Oh, come on, going through the pier tunnel. Go through the pier tunnel. Um, wait. Alright. You know what, don't go the, through the pier tunnel. We're turning around. Turning around. Uh, so now you un I'm hoping now I people understand why I think that Watch Mojo video was one of their various mistakes. I'm thinking this might actually be the last video I do today, because... <clears throat> Mainly I wanted to go back to this Let's Play, because I do have a viewer that really wants to see the videos in this Let's Play. So, because of that, I needed to make something to put out. But I can make more later. Okay, Nico. Nice. Put the gun away. We don't need it right now. Alright, how far is Jacob? Not that far. Yo, I, I swear to God if it was possible to fall down that hole, but I'm not risking it. And I probably just went the wrong way. Wait, there's a ladder. Yeah, that's definitely possible to go fall down that hole. It's here on the map? Oh my god, I think I know where to lure... I know where to lure Burger Man next time. Hi, Jacob. Jacob, what are you talking about? You know, I think you're smoking too much. Yo, me think me know to eat and then here comes hey, the Nico. biggest plot twist on the face hey, of the Nico. earth. What are you doing here? This is no place for you, Michelle. As it happens, it is. After, this is what Michelle does after we don't go on a date with her ever again. After the first time. I'm afraid it's my job to watch you. And now... I have to ask you for the coke. This is a joke, right? Please, please don't make this harder for me than it already is. Look, they're about to take down Elizabeth. I don't 
fucking believe this? Listen, I'm sorry it had to be this way, Nico. I'm really sorry. Hey, you know, you could have gone down too if you weren't so useful. You know, now that I think about it, like, the last mission we do for Elisabetta, I know how it goes down on Nico's end, but uh, I'm wondering how it's referenced on Johnny's end. Well, my employers need the help of a guy like Nico. The office is in Algonquin. I'll call you. You know, as and when we need you. Michelle sounding like the G-Man from Half-Life. Okay, another mission complete. And now I want to take a taxi. Back to our safe house. Thank you. And we're going to do a manual save. Uh oh. Oh, Bruce, he's telling me to go to Perseus. Alright, save our game, and I think that'll do it for today. Freaking replacing a save file that's exactly one year old. Feels a bit surreal. Alright, see you all next video.